Five employees, A, B, C, D, and E are five employees working in a company. In two successive years, each of them got hikes in his salary as follows. A gets P and P plus one. B gets P plus two and P minus one. P plus three and P minus two. P plus four and P minus three. P plus five and P minus four. If all of them have the same salary at the end of two years, who got the least hike in a salary? So A gets P percent and then P plus one percent. A, whatever A salary was, P percent hike, P plus one percent hike takes us to new salary. B, P plus two, P minus one, new salary. These two are equal. First thing here, we cannot afford to think about this question algebraically. When you then go to a, on a wild goose chase, God knows where we'll go. And I'm going to plug in some numbers and see where it takes us. Importantly, if you see, P becomes P plus 2, P plus 1 becomes P minus 1. Plus 1, minus 1, plus 1, minus 1, plus 1, minus 1. You'll notice that this becomes a very simple question. You get one funda right. So I'm going to plug in a number for P, then take it from there. So 10%, P is 10. P plus 1 is 11. 12 percent. And 9 percent. Right, so I'm going to call this as P plus 1 and P percent. Subtract 1, add 1. That's how it goes. Right? 11 and 10. 13 and 8. 14 and 7. 15 and 6. Wonderful. You have a number. Forget this 11%. 11% makes it 1.11 times what it was into 1.10. 1.12 times into 1.09. 1.13 times into 1.08. You notice all of these numbers add up to 2.21. This is 2.21. This is 2.21. These two are very close to each other. The last two. 1.15 into 1.06. They are very far from each other. Fine. So, if you had the same number to start with, then you'll have a larger number to end with here. If sum of two numbers is 10, 5 into 5 is greater than 4 into 6, greater than 3 into 7, greater than 2 into 8, or greater than 1 into 9. If the sum is the same, then closer the numbers are, the higher the product is. Right? Now, if all of them have got the same salary, who got the least hike? They ended up at the same point. But who was, who had the highest amount to start with? For whom is this impact the least? This impact is going to be least for the guy for whom the percentages are far apart. P plus 5 and P minus 4. For that guy, the impact is going to be the least or answer choices. E, which is choice A. I've got a brilliant question based on just this idea. The funda or the idea is important. If the sum of two numbers is given, the product is maximum when the numbers are as close to each other as possible. We all know this, but it's applied in a slightly different context here. And so here it is into 1.11 into 1.0. Here it is into 1.15 into 1.06. All the end points are same. The impact of this is the smallest or E should have had the highest salary beforehand and the least hike during the two years to arrive at the same end point. Who got the least hike? E.